Priscilla Presley, 77, was reported last month to have contested the authenticity and validity of her daughter Lisa Marie Presley's will, after Riley Keough and her late brother Benjamin were left as co-trustees. It has now been claimed that Priscilla and Riley aren't communicating, leaving the latter heartbroken to be dealing with such a dispute. Lisa Marie went into cardiac arrest at her home in Los Angeles and was pronounced dead later on January 12, aged 54. Priscilla was reported by Page Six to have filed documents challenging a purported 2016 amendment to her late daughter's will, which ousted her as a trustee. According to documents obtained by the outlet, Priscilla has asked the judge to determine the validity of the amendment, which named Riley and her late brother as successor co-trustees. The amendment allegedly removed Lisa Marie's former business manager Barry Siegel, along with Priscilla, from the trust. An insider close to the family has now told Entertainment Tonight that Priscilla and Riley are no longer talking due to Priscilla's decision to contest the will. The source said, Riley has been mourning the loss of her mother and is heartbroken to have to deal with a trust dispute with a family member. Priscilla is adamant that she has a valid case and that she will prevail in court. Riley and Priscilla aren't communicating at this time, but have been in communication through lawyers. The source added that Riley would have rather settled the dispute privately, however, both ladies are reportedly gearing up for a long court battle. In the court filing, Priscilla claims that she and Siegel were first named co-trustees in January 1992, when Lisa Marie executed a revocable living trust, which she amended and completely restated on Jan. 27, 2010. However, after her daughter died on January 12, Lisa Marie claims to have found a new amendment, which was dated March 11, 2016. Elvis Presley's ex-wife alleges that her daughter's signature on the 2016 document appears inconsistent with her usual and customary signature. She also claimed that the document was never notarized, and had not been delivered to her during Lisa Marie's lifetime, as laid out in the terms of the 2010 trust arrangement. Page Six said that Priscilla claimed Siegel has already or will soon resign as a co-trustee of the trust. Lisa Marie's financial issues have been well documented over the years, notably with her 2018 lawsuit against Seigel. The late singer accused Seigel of negligence and mishandling her sizable inheritance from Elvis. According to documents filed at the time, Lisa Marie claimed her ex-business manager left her in financial ruin, with just $14,000 in cash by 2016. Siegel then countersued Lisa Marie for $800,000 in unpaid bills. Priscilla's latest court filings also come less than a week after Lisa Marie was laid to rest at Graceland alongside her son Benjamin. Priscilla shared a message on Twitter last month, thanking the world for their support at this troubling time. She wrote, Thank you all for your condolences, you have touched me with your words. It has been a very difficult time but just knowing your love is out there makes a difference.